fans. Uh, what was I gonna say? So you're gonna say you're gonna introduce yourself. Who am I? Hey Muppet fans, this is Joe. And I'm Louie. And we're here from ToughPigs.com. We are. We are here with the very latest in Fraggle Rock toys. Did you know there was new Fraggle Rock toys? Uh, I didn't, but I do know now. That's right, the good people at Kid Robot donated this whole box of Fraggle Rock blind box vinyl figures to us, and we are gonna go through and open up a whole bunch of these for you on camera. And uh, after, <laughs> not after that. <laughs> and in another video, we're gonna be opening these keychains that are also blind box keychains from Kid Robot, so take a look out for that. That's right. So for now, there are 10 different figures that you can get in these little blind boxes. We're gonna open up as many of them as we can until we get to see all 10. So let's find out what's inside. Yeah, yeah, this is very exciting for us. I mean, just to have like an entire like tray of figures that you can open up. Yeah. I mean, like this is what everybody everybody wants to do in, a, in like a toy store. It right? really is. This yeah. is the dream. So here it is. This is the first box. Opening it up. Okay. And oh boy, what is it? Who's uh, it gonna be? Oh, oh. it's Cotter Pin Doozer. Look at the that. Doozer who wanted to be an individual, who wanted to be a Fraggle. Yes, and there's at least three of her those individuals in this. In this. That's box. right, identical versions. Yes. Great. All, All right, right, here's I'm gonna open up the next one. Here it is. It's gonna be. Oh, it's Sprocket. it's Sprocket! Okay, so Sprocket, we found out, is gonna be, he's only, he's the rarest one. Um, yeah, we found him second. Yeah, we, yeah, he's the second one we he's opened like up. He's like the chase figure. He yeah. is. So there's only one in each crate. There's one, You have a one in 24 chance of getting Sprocket. Look how adorable he is. He actually he's a good dog. has a great sculpt to yes. him. I love the sculpt on the fur. Totally. And uh, the head uh, comparatively to the body, like yes. the large head. It's a great, that's a great figure. I agree. Okay, here we go. Next up, we've got... Ooh. Oh! That's a good uh, boober. Yeah, so what do we think about this boober? Uh, he's a little derpy, but I love him. <laughs> well, but look, the boober's a little derpy. He is, look, he's got like a, like a, if you turn him sideways, he's got a little hunch in his neck. He looks oh, a, little, yeah. a little sad. That's great, actually. I do him. love that. Yeah, and also look at the way the tie goes from like the main body of the skull to onto the leg. That's yeah. kind of cool too. It is. Awesome. All right, let's keep moving. It's another doozer. It's another, oh, another cotter pin. It's another All cotter right. pin because we know we're gonna find a lot of cotter pins. That's right. Because they're more common. Oh, this is very laborious. There's, it's I'm hard just, being a I toy can't collector stand attention. in 2019. It's Cotter Pin! <laughs> Wait, so Cotter Pin is, there's one in, th there's three in this box. So we've found all the Cotter Pins. Yeah. Great, all right. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully this is not Cotter Pin. It could be Cotter Pin. It could be Cotter Pin. It's Cotter, no, just kidding. It's Moki! Oh, this is a cool Moki. That is a cool Moki. Look at how big her head is. Yeah. And look who I found. It's another boomer. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're gonna keep moving. Should we edit this out? I don't know. Maybe this will be really entertaining. I don't know. It's... Oh, oh, okay. Oh, this, this is, one has all construction. This is, you... a, this is a kinder surprise. Okay, so <laughs> this is bald red. That's a nightmare. <laughs> oh no, oh, but she came you know, with, she looks with like hair. One, she looks like one of Kermit's like cousins. Bows in the back? No, bows should go in the front. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So there we go. Them. Oh yeah. yeah, that's right. Oh, cool, yeah. All right, there's Red with her hair. Yep. So we almost have, well, we have three out of five. Right. And it's funny because Gobo's actually supposed to be the most common fraggle and we haven't found him yet. That's right. Um, cool. All right. What's okay. next? Hopefully Gobo. <laughs> Here we go. Is it Gobo? Oh, it's another red. It's another ball ah! red. Maybe this is Gobo. It probably isn't. It's another doozer. Oh, no, the we haven't seen this doozer yet. This is the architect. This doozer. is the architect doozer. So the doozers are slightly smaller. Like each of the fraggles is like three heads high and each of the doozers is like two heads high. Yeah. Which is cool. Right. Because that works for the, you know, the proportions that for the show. Also makes me think that um, I just want uh, a giant Gorg kid robot figures. Let's see who this is. And it's... Aha! Oh, it's a it's new one! It's Wembley. It is Wembley. Uh, Wembley's hard to get in figure form because he's got such a unique nose and they kind of just 
abandoned the nose, but it still looks like Wembley. Yeah, well, I like the Hawaiian shirt. The yeah. pattern on the Hawaiian shirt is really good. It's his banana tree shirt. Yeah. Who, it's, where would he be without his banana tree shirt? It's it's awesome. He'd be naked. Great. He would be naked. That's right. Next box. Here we go. What's in here? It is... Wembley! Wembley! Oh, wait, something fell out. Oh, his arm fell off. <laughs> oh! It's, it's a special chase Wembley where he only has one arm. Oh, no, one-armed Wembley. Oh, boy. See how fast I did that? You. It was very fast. Look at this little oh. doozer! So that's just like, basically, like an anything doozer. It is. Right? That's not one of the actual characters. That's just a doozer that would appear on the show. This is my favorite doozer. Wrench flange doozer. You're making him up. That's oh, yeah. not a real. Okay. All right. Let's see who this is. Here we go. Fraggle Rock. It's a bag. <laughs> just That's my favorite Fraggle. Just it's in the case, bag. Just in case you didn't know that this was a Fraggle Rock uh, collection of figures. Yep. Oh, it's. Oh. This is the other, uh, like, anything doozer. Great. So now we found all the doozers. All four doozers. Okay. So I love the stash on this doozer. Yeah. He's rocking a good stash. So is the architect, though. So yeah. They, they're they great. How do you think doozers shave? It's a doozer. Yay! It's just another doozer. Okay, here we go. Oh, Joe's so angry. I'm so angry. Where's Gobo? He must it's be out. It's a dude. Oh my god! Yay. We're gonna go through this entire box looking for Gobo. Maybe Gobo isn't included in this box. It's a doozer. It's a doozer. It's another doozer. Is it Gobo? It's. Go, but no, just kidding. It's a doozer. Oh my! <laughs> I was pretty excited for a second. Oh, it is. thank goodness it is. <laughs> it's Gobo. Wow, look at that hair. Okay, crazy so, hair. Let's, so this is our last figure that we need to open. So let's look at him. Yes. How come they didn't make a traveling mat? I would Maybe that'll be mat. in the next collection. Mm. I feel like a traveling mat, like chase figure, would be the way to go. Right. Could be. Yeah. So these are the four doozer figures. Yeah. I think they're cute. I think they're I, cute, and I also really d I appreciate, as I did with the Fraggles as well, how really how different they all are. Yeah, like look, you look at just their noses. Like they've got you know several different size noses. Yeah, they're, they're not all from the same the same build. And I I, I kind of love the idea of getting a whole bunch of these and covering my like my work desk with like 50 doozers. That's a really good point. Yeah. You could, that would be really, really fun. Yeah, yeah, you can definitely make displays with them. So Louie, what do you think of these guys? Would you would you buy some? Yeah, I, I really like the attention to detail put into them. And to be honest, I actually like them a little more than I thought I would. Yeah. Like, I think they're, they're yeah. really cool and they would look really good, definitely on it. And they definitely would look great on a desk or a shelf. And for younger kids, like they would be fun to play with too. Yeah. Like they're definitely durable enough to play with. They're yeah, we've not, dropped them several times. They're not just like adult toys. Like they're not yeah. just toys for collectors either. That's so true. They, they kind of straddle a few different markets, which is great. Yeah. I think I think they're a winner. I think that everyone should go out and, and buy a couple of themselves and see which one they get. And don't have your heart set on Gobo because apparently he's way at the bottom. Yeah, totally. And, uh, you know, click on our other video that is going to be us opening the keychains. That's you're right. If you interested in the keychains as well. Hey, do you want to have some of these for free? Well, guess what? If you go over to toughpigs.com, we're having a contest. And you can find out how you can get uh, the, all of these that we just opened for free. Surprise! Surprise! Win some fraggles! Yay! And then make sure you uh, go and buy them wherever <laughs> kid robot toys are sold. Toy stores, comic shops, online. Mm hmm And then eat them. Yeah. No, they're don't not. Don't eat them. They're not They're, they're, not they're made out of plastic. Don't do that. That's don't actually do that. a terrible idea. Yeah, don't eat them. No. Don't eat these. Let the music play. Down at Fraggle Rock. Down at Fraggle Rock. Down at Fraggle Rock. Down at Fraggle Rock.